Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to upgrade the hardware compatibility of a virtual machine when you upgrade your VMware Workstation software. So this is uh, VMware Workstation 17, looks just like 16, but as you can see here, uh, the virtual machines are still 16.2x uh, uh, for the hardware compatibility version. So just because you update your uh, Workstation software doesn't mean your VMs are going to be upgraded as well, but fortunately it's a real simple process to upgrade them, so that way they'll be able to take advantage of the newest features. So let's say on this one, which is a Windows 11 VM, all we have to do is right click on it, go to manage, and change hardware compatibility, and I'll run you through this wizard here. So it says right now it's 16.2, and there's compatible products here. When you So this, this list here shows the compatible products for 16.2. You could change this to 17. You could also downgrade if you want. So this is compatible products, Fusion 13 and Workstation 17. And you can see the limitations compared to a 16, so 128 gig memory, 32 processors, 10 network adapters. Pretty much the same limitations as 16, but you'll have the compatible products upgraded to 17. So all you gotta do is click on next. So next you're asked if you want to create a clone of the virtual machine, just in case something goes wrong, I suppose. And that way you'll still have your 16.x you know, older version. Or you could alter this actual VM and not make a clone. Which is what I'm going to do because my VMs are not super important. So I'm not worried about it. And I've never had a problem with this anyways. So click on next. And then finish. Close. And now you can see the uh, hardware compatibility is now Workstation 17x. So it's a real simple process, so you know, unfortunately you just have to do that one at a time to all your VMs. So if you have a lot of them, it'll take you a little bit of time. But fortunately the procedure is pretty quick. So once again, just right click on it, manage, change compatibility, go through the wizard, and you'll be good to go. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.